Hi there. What you see here is an MTD brand rototiller equipped with a 5 horsepower Honda GC160 GC160 engine. I'm doing this video today because I have a problem with the engine. Uh, whenever I run the engine it seems to start just fine but after 30 seconds to a minute it stalls out. So I've gone through this engine, I've checked the exhaust to make sure that I don't have a screen there which may be plugged up and preventing exhaust from coming out and causing the engine to stall out. I've also removed the head cover to look at the belt, the belt looks good. Timing is right when I've got the piston at top dead center. Uh, the belt line, not the belt, but the cam lines up properly with the top of the head. I've uh, removed the air filter, make sure that it's absolutely clean as can be. I've run it without the air filter and the same type of thing happens. I've taken the carburetor completely apart and cleaned it. I have a fair amount of experience cleaning out carburetors and for this one I was able to get the main jets right out. Uh, clean everything there as best as I can, spray some carb cleaner in, use my air compressor to blow air through it. Everything seems to be normal there. I can't see anything wrong with it. I removed the fuel tank. I drained it completely, flipped it upside down. I did find some debris in it, but um, after that was cleaned out, fresh gas was put in. I used uh, unleaded gas with uh, sea foam poured in to help clean the carburetor, and uh, still the very same issue. I also checked the fuel cap. The fuel cap is right. It's uh, allowing venting to happen if that's what's necessary. It's not plugged. It doesn't have any junk behind the venting cap. So I believe everything there is okay. So what I'm looking for here is wondering if anybody has any experience dealing with this and any solutions they might have found for it. Uh, what I can say is I... I to the end of what I can say about it basically. Uh, it just will run for a minute or so, maybe not even that. It starts real easy. It'll run for a minute or so, then die out, and then I have trouble starting it again afterwards. Uh, I bet you right now if I were to pull on the cord, it would start almost immediately with the choke out and it would run until it, you know, for a minute or so until it dies. I did not do anything to the fuel pump yet. That's my next uh, target area. I was thinking possibly there's something inside the fuel pump or one of the vacuum lines that run that operates the fuel pump is clogged, but I don't know about that yet. I need to take it apart and I'll do that next. If anybody has any suggestions on what I should go look at or if they've repaired this kind of issue before, give me a shout. I'd be happy to consider what you've got to say and give it a try. I'll, I'll give it a shot now. I'll pull on the rope, see if the engine starts and watch it from there. Let's just do that. There's a typical example of what happens. It'll run for about 30 seconds, 45 seconds. Now if I pull on the rope, it will not start. I have to give it some time. It's almost like the fuel bowl in the carburetor is empty and I need to give it time for it to refill through gravity. Any thoughts or suggestions would be much appreciated. Thanks. Bye-bye.